Jesus Christ, that's a pretty face. Kind you'd find on someone that could save if they don't put me away. Hey, what's up, guys? How's everyone doing? Um, just wanted to do a quick update video. I am got a nice little list of notes here. Um, 2,330 days on T, which basically is six years and a little over four months um, on T. So um, that's kind of crazy that I've been on T that long. Um, I still, it seems like yesterday, but then it also seems like a lifetime ago when I was just starting to go to the clinic and stuff to start the process to get on testosterone and then getting my script and mailing it to Portland and waiting for it to come in the mail. So it's definitely huge that I am over six years on testosterone now. Um, Health-wise, I have Kaiser Healthcare um, hold on. with my work. So um, I'm pursuing getting a histo covered with them so far um also they cover lower surgery options with crane and Meltzer, so i'm uh, just beginning to look into those results and things like that i have no uh decisions made on what if any lower surgery i am gonna have um but i do want a hysterectomy within the next year so since I was already on testosterone when I got Kaiser, I didn't have to go through any of the uh, therapy work to get my letter. They just continued my testosterone. But now that I want surgeries covered, I have to have two Kaiser therapists sign off. Because um, I already have my own therapist, but their, her letter wouldn't count, I guess. So I just saw the first lady and I see the second lady in the beginning of uh, December. I'll make a separate healthcare video and kind of map out all of the stuff that I've been doing with that and getting my things covered through my healthcare, which is really awesome because I paid for uh, my top surgery myself because they didn't cover any doctors that I wanted to have top surgery with. So speaking of top surgery, I'm 307 uh, oh, days with Dr. Garamoni. Um, pretty happy with it. It's pretty smooth everywhere. Um, this side's a little bit thicker and then I do have a little bit of a raised one right here but it's uh, gone down a lot in the last month or so. Um, I've been taking a swim class every Tuesday and Thursday uh, so that has really helped me um, build my chest muscle and upper body muscle I'll put in a picture shows like right after surgery to now um, so that's pretty cool um, I definitely think that that class dramatically helped um, fill out my chest and then I've been trying to go to the gym at least once or twice a week on top of that class um, December 5th no, sixth, me and my fiance are doing our second 5K this year. The first one I wasn't really planning on doing, just kind of was a situation that fell in my lap. And um, then we decided to sign up for this one. It's a really, like, not serious 5K. The first one we did was the color run, so it's just supposed to be, like, have a good time, and they splat you with powdered color the whole run. This one is the electric run, so it's from, like, 7 to 10 at night. It's all, like, neon-themed or whatever, so I got a really awesome... Uh, neon yellow outfit that I'm going to wear with it. I'll probably show a picture. And yeah, other than that, um, work-wise, things have been a little rough lately at work because everyone's just kind of roaring out from all the excitement of summer and now it's getting slow and there's just like petty drama going on. So the like negative attitude, um, just seems to domino effect to everyone um hopefully that'll improve since our slow season's coming on us we all have time to like regroup and relax and kind of refocus our priorities um but i'm planning on signing up for school again next semester so i'm really excited about that um i'm only going to be my first year into my general ed classes then 
that I'm trying to get into this radiology program, but I need uh, this random list of GE classes before I can apply for the lottery system for the radiology tech program. So, um, also this week is Transgender Day of Remembrance. Um, the author of Stone Butch Blues passed away, which is definitely um, really sad for our community. Uh, I definitely want to start getting involved in more trans activism awareness, like education type stuff. I have a friend who works for a hospital and um, participates in panels of like incoming med students. So um, when I saw my therapist recently, I mentioned to her that I'd be interested in being involved in something like that. So hopefully in 2015, um, I'll be able to kind of be more involved in that way because especially in the healthcare system, I feel like that should be something that's more of a in introductory stages, not just a specialty case or whatever. So um, our experiences just going in and getting regular things done at the hospital aren't uncomfortable or uh, unsafe. So um, I think that's about it. I hope everyone has a great weekend. I'm about to go see Cold War Kids in concert, and I'm really excited about that. Uh, and I'm going to get a tattoo tomorrow. So yeah, it's kind of my Christmas present to myself. It's a little early because she's about to, my tattoo artist is going out of town for the holidays. Um, if you guys have any questions or anything you want me to talk about, leave a comment below, follow my journey on Instagram, have a good weekend.